out details on a major investment in North Downtown. The Kiewit Foundation is revealing a big project meant to bring an arts and trades district to Omaha. KETV News Watch 7's Alexandra Stone is live. Grandy, the Peter Kiewit Foundation started talking about this project back in 2008. Then in 2011, they actually formed Future Forward LLC and started buying up properties here north of the ballpark. In fact, Future Forward actually owns many of the buildings right here along 11th, and they own 25 acres in this neighborhood. Now, it was all fairly secretive until recently, as everything's growing full of life and art. You've got the walnut that was actually cut from a slab out of a tree. A warehouse full of wood, reclaimed from trees and century old homes, now ready for new life. Turning that into something that's really useful, uh, that is beautiful, uh, that somebody is going to have be with their family for generations, that's sort of the whole premise of this business. Jason Gilbreth's reclaimed enterprises, just one tenant in property owned by the Kiewit Foundation. The foundation formed Future Forward LLC and now owns 12 properties between 11th and 16th Streets near Cumming. The foundation said in a statement Future Forward intends to make the properties it owns affordable for the creative class. Entrepreneurs, artisans, craftsmen, techies. That community of creativity, something Gilbreth appreciates. Collaborating with craftsmen right next door. Today I started on um, a credenza and also a desk. The hum of machinery fills the room and sawdust spills onto the floor at another foundation-owned property. Kyle Peterson's project on Monday designed at Reclaimed Enterprises. Every day is, is a little bit different and that's actually kind of why I really enjoy the job. The foundation's investment followed other creative development in the area, hot shops and the master craft leading the way. Now the work spurring new development, apartments just opening on 14th. Yeah, and I can... For Gilbreth, about to mark one year in this space, there's a sense of reclaiming something more than materials, reclaiming a piece of the city. I just see Omaha as having the opportunity to build something that's pretty unique in this area. As for what's next, designs are in the works for markers at the entry points of the neighborhood, and Future Forward LLC actually places covenants on these buildings to make sure the people leasing them fit their vision for the neighborhood. Alexander Stone reporting live tonight. Thanks. And